Welcome back everybody to the YouTube channel. Today I have a new tool I wanna to break down, the Leatherman Wave Plus. Let's go check it out. Before breaking down in the tool, please take the time and hit that like button, and that helps out the YouTube algorithm for us so we can continue to grow the channel. First off, they created a really long name for this, so I actually have to read it to you. It is the Leatherman Limited Edition Wave Plus tool with premium wire cutters, spring action scissors, nylon sheathing, built in the USA with stars and stripe black ox <laughs> black oxide where do they come up with these names? Just call it the Wave Plus with the paint job. But anyways, the real reason why I bought this tool was because of the paint job. Let, let's be honest. All right. Anyways, let's stop bragging about it. Let's break into it. And they say it comes with 18 feature features. I think that is a little bit of a stretch, but let's break it down and see if there is. Breaking out the Leatherman Wave, the first thing you want to look at is the box, right? A lot of people love boxes. I'm not a huge, I don't really care as long as the tool is real nice, but I do have to say their packaging is really nice. Opens up, you have their logo, and then they come with an instruction manual of how to operate the tool, which is good if you have never owned a Leatherman before, or if you read instructions. <laughs> All right, so next thing is, is, the first thing I notice about the Leatherman Wave is it is a little bit smaller than their other Leathermans, uh, which is perfectly fine. I actually think a smaller tool to reduce the amount of weight on your pants is actually pretty nice. So uh, it, it moves pretty smoothly. The first thing I noticed, I tried recording this a few times and you can see even touching it, they put a lot of oil on their tool, which is good, it protects it and it will function really well when you first open the box. The next thing is, is I purchased it for the paint job, but the thing is, is the paint job isn't on the back, which I'm not a fan of. I think they should have had it transparent from front to back, I feel like just cutting a little bit of corners there. Opening up the tool, so let's start going over the features. The first feature is it comes with this case. This case is super nice, and I had one before, and I carried my Leatherman in it for about a year, and then the case started to break. I predict the same thing for about this case. It it operates really well. It fits in there real snug. Uh, the 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 stitching looks really nice too as well. So, oh, there's already a stitch coming loose right there, but you just probably can burn that off and it'll be fine. It snaps together and it won't move around too much. So that's gonna be nice. So moving in to the 18 features, item number one, it, is always the pliers. They're known for their pliers. The upgraded feature on these Wave Plus pliers is you can change out the noses, which is really good. The next one is the wire cutters and then the heavy wire cutters too as well. Moving on to the next item, which they call these wire crimpers in the back of the tool, in the back of the tool there. The next item is they call this the wire stripper. The wire stripper is located on the can opener and they're called this this right here the wire stripper moving on to the next feature what they what they have in order on their website is the knife which I do like this feature yes they didn't have the it painted front and back but it definitely added the nice touch of adding the stars and the flag onto the knife which I am a fan of moving on to the next knife which is the serrated knife which is right here. This is good for cutting, I don't know, rope and sheetrock, uh, just the serrated portion, a seat belt. Oh, look, it even caught me there, which it caught me right there. And I, everybody that was breaking down the tool, I uh, kept wondering why their hands were so dirty on the other YouTube channels. And I was like, oh, it's because they have oil and grease all over the tool. So you have the serrated knife. Next item is the saw. We'll open up the saw here. It looks really nice. I'm not a huge fan of saws on the multi-tools. I don't use them too often, but it will do, it'll pass. So all the tools on the outside, you have the knife, the saw, the serrated blade, and then the next one is the file. I am a big fan of the file. Yes, it's meant for other things, but I actually use this to file down my nails more often than not. So I'm a huge fan of the file. So the other multi-tools, the other Leathermans don't come with files, which I'm pretty upset about. So this is the main reason why I'm switching over to the Leatherman Way Plus, not just the paint job. So opening up 
opening up the Leatherman here, you have rulers on both sides. And the next reason why I really wanted to purchase the Wave Plus here is the scissors. I feel like this goes back to the Swiss Army knife days and the scissors are extremely important. You would be surprised how often you do need scissors when you're opening up things or having a regular small tool. So these tools come in handy and how you release it is this little lever in the back and the tool closes. Moving on to the next one, you have the can opener bottle opener, which is on this side of the tool. You have the bo bottle opener can opener and you'll be using the bottle opener more than more often than not. And then we talked about it already. You have the, the wire strippers here. Moving on to the next items is you have the drivers. So you have the, the, the Phillips head or the flat head, sorry. And then you have the Phillips head here, which is, which is really nice. And then you have to move to the other side, which is you have just the, the large flat head driver. And then you have, I think this is a really nice added on feature is the, is the sunglasses or the, the mini driver you'd be surprised how often you need something like this to pick something out or tighten your tighten your glasses. So there you go, that is the breakdown of the Leatherman Wave Plus. Yes, it is a really nice tool. It operates really smoothly. It is fairly small too as well. And you'll be able to accomplish a lot of little daily tasks without having to surf through your entire toolbox just to, I don't know, cut a wire, pull something out, you know, saw something, cut something. You're not gonna be able to accomplish every task in the entire world with it, but it will be able to suffice something quick on the fly. I do recommend carrying one of these tools in your vehicle or on your belt at all times. And if you like this type of content, please take the time and smash that like button down below and hit the subscribe and I'll continue breaking down tools and follow us on our home inspections. All right, thanks guys. Catch us out on the next one. Bye.